thank you for popping in here and uh, wanting to check out this quick video. All right, so I'm just going to get started to it. Uh, my name is Poi TB. I'm the Asian guy on the left hand side with a pink shirt. I'm the founder of Mad Mastermind and I have created tons of products and also run some workshop in the past uh, related to Facebook marketing and uh, social media and also personal development stuff. Now, in this video, I'm, I'm promising you that how to have a advertise on Facebook for free. But first, let me explain to you why you want to know this. And, uh, and, and here, here it is. By knowing how to advertise for free, you can make more money and never have to worry about cash flow problems. And number two, relax. You know, like just enjoy it and don't have to worry about running out of traffic or traffic uh, leads or clients. Then number three, you can scale and hire more people to take care of your business for you. Right, so you can actually enjoy, you know, with more choices, more freedom, uh, opportunities in life and uh, to do what you want and when you want it. And, and that's the main goal in life. And here is the secret. It is really all about knowing your numbers. Okay, every time I get on a phone call with potential customers, I always ask these four simple questions. And I want you to grab your pen and papers and work it out with me here right now. You know, I mean, look, if you want to start advertising on Facebook for free, that is. All right, have you got it? All right, here we go. First one, know your number, right? How much did you spend on your advertising campaign? Uh, it's a pretty straightforward question. How much do you spend on your advertising campaign? The second question is, how much do you make out of that campaign? The third question, how much money does it cost you to get a new customer or acquire a new customer? I'm just going to break it down so you can work with me here. So let's I come up with a quick example for this one as well. So how much do you spend on advertising campaign? It's very simple. You just add all the advertising costs together. For example, the last campaign you ran, uh, in this case, is 600 bucks on Facebook ads. Uh, it's about $20 per day. Uh, so let's assume that we run for 30 days. Right, so the total spend on this advertising campaign is six hundred dollars. Okay, all right. Next question: How much do you make? Again, I mean, this is very simple. You just add all the net profit together, and what a net profit is, like you know, some of you may have a hard cost for selling a product. For example, you might sell a TV, and you only got two hundred dollars commission, but TV itself is, you know, two grand, whatever, and therefore your net profit is two hundred bucks. Right. Uh, in this example, I just um, use uh, pretty straight, easy number. Last campaign generated three new customers and 42 leads. So the first customer purchased a product and a net profit of $70, right? It might be an online training program. It might be something small. It might be a physical item, whatever it is. Second and the third customer though, they purchased a service from you, which is a net profit of $990. Now, if you add those three figures together, $70 plus 990 plus 980, that's equal to 2050 bucks, right? I want to put another another area in there, which is 42 leads equals zero dollar, right? I mean, it's very important to understand that, yes, yeah, sure, you might get more money in the future from those leads, but right now from this very campaign, your net profit from those leads is zero dollar. Yeah, I just want to make it clear. Now the next question is, how much money does it cost you to acquire a new customer? Look, we mentioned we got three customers and we spent 600 bucks. Therefore, you know, 600 divided by three equal $200. So cost per acquiring a new customer for you is $200. Now let's put all the figures in one place and explain to you how it all work. And uh, so first of all, we spend an advertising campaign of 600 bucks and you made a sale, like you made sales uh, of $2,050. Now, cost per acquiring a customer is $200 per customer. Therefore, okay, out of this $2,050 net profit minus the $600 ad spend, it is $1,450 profit. Pretty, pretty straight mathematic. Or uh, the other way you can look at it is, you know, I only need to get one customer to be in profit for this campaign, right? I mean, if you're gonna cost me 200 bucks and I will make, you know, like about $600, hey, it's a happy day. All I need to know is if you just get one customer, I be in profit. It doesn't matter how much I spend. Oh, I mean, sorry, as long as uh, I spend about um, under uh, $200. All right, so the fourth question and the big question here is how much did the traffic, lead, and customer cost you? 
nothing. Exactly, this, you didn't cost you anything at all. You just made yourself a $1,450 in profit. Okay, so here's the thing. If you don't advertise, and like for example with this campaign, you actually in fact losing a thousand dollars and for one thousand four hundred fifty dollars in your business. Okay, where did you get that number from? Well, you know, like it's a profit that you could make, but because you don't advertise, therefore you lose that money. Okay. All right. So let me show you some of my customers. Right. Okay. So John Dwyer, the guy on the right, with creamy jacket okay he's a owner of and a founder of institute of wow and um, we run a campaign for eight weeks okay and that's cost him three thousand dollars and seventy eight point six four cent and the result of that is we generated two hundred and seventy seven customers this is not including leads at all just customers okay so cost per acquiring customer is eleven dollars so like eleven point eleven uh, the front end sales we made Ten thousand and eighty-eight dollars back end sales. Some of the speakers, as you may know, they sell more stuff, but uh, due to privacy reason, we're not gonna uh, enclose that. And uh, just the profit from the main campaign itself is seven thousand eight hundred and nine dollars and thirty-six cents. Return on investment of this is two hundred and fifty-four percent. It's pretty crazy. Right, and that's not including the back end stuff. The next one, I got uh, Tamika Hudo from Holistic Wellness Coaching. She spent a thousand three hundred and seventeen dollars and nine cents for the five week campaign we ran together, and in res the result of that is we generated one hundred and twenty nine opt ins, and opt in just mean people are actually registered. Out of one hundred twenty nine people, eighty people turn up and they're actually interested um, in her products and services. Okay, she, they they went ahead, and out of that she were able to close 12 customers or 12 people. So therefore, cost per acquiring a customer is $109.76. And how I got that figure? $1,317 divided by 12, we got 109.76. Now, she sold, um, you know, like the total um, sales that she got is $31,900. Therefore, the profit of this campaign is uh, $28,000 and $82.91. Return on investment, 631.86%. It's pretty awesome there. Last one, Top Care Chiropractic. He's a chiropractor, as you can see, in uh, North Ride, which is in Sydney. And uh, he spent $487.50 for two weeks. In result, he got 12 customers, all right? So cost per acquiring each customer is $40.63. Because of the, the way he works is the lifetime value of each customer is about two grand instead of like per sale, right? Is $2,000 per year. So we're just gonna go with one year here. Um, therefore, um, he would make about $24,000 and uh, out of that, he, and, and because he said to me that, you know, he can usually retain, um, nearly like 90, 95% of the time. So we went with that figure and um, $24,000. Therefore, he basically would made $23,512.50, which return on investment is 4,723% uh, return on investment for him. Look, let's say for some reason, a customer drop off or whatever reason that is, is still a very impressive number. Like return on investment is still gonna be pretty, pretty high. Okay, now I'm gonna leave you with these questions though. How much new traffic leads customers and money and how much is it costing you every month to not be advertising on Facebook? What I want to do here is look guys, if you're interested, I'm gonna open up a, a free 15 minutes consultation just uh, with me and uh, we can have a look at, hey, what are you doing right now? What is what is stopping you? How can we make it better? Come up with strategies. And if you are the right fit, we, we can work together. If not, that's okay. We're still friends and you can actually take away the strategies and probably implement it yourself and whatnot. So guys, the, the link on the screen is poitb.com.au forward slash qualify. Okay, it is poitb.com.au forward slash qualify. Okay, we just type in uh, that email, then we go to the questionnaire. And what I need you to do is just fill out the questionnaire so I know a bit more information about what you do and how you do things and how you operate at the moment and what industry you are in.
okay and uh, i want to see as well whether um you know we we are the right match for each other whether it can e even help you in the first place and yeah so once you've added information give me a day or two and i will get back to you and reach out back to you we set up a time together and we can actually have a conversation all right so i'm just gonna leave uh, at this call and again guys uh it is poitb.com.au for such qualify and my question was you know how much you know do you want like how much money lead customers whatever it is for you do you want and how much is it costing you every month to not be advertising on facebook okay again my name is poi tb thank you very much for watching this and i really appreciate it I'll speak to you soon